Adair County Clerk Sandy Collip is suing County Commissioners Mark Shahan, Bill King and Mark Thompson individually and the Adair County Commission as a whole. Collip accuses the commissioners of deleting a small portion of security footage and violating Missouri Sunshine Law. KTBO's Nick Todorovich breaks down the allegations outlined in the lawsuit filed Thursday in Adair County Circuit Court. Court documents say that on January 23rd, First District Commissioner Bill King raised his voice at Collip and then gestured as if to physically remove her from the office. Fast forward to February 21st and Collip requested video recordings of that incident. Documents say an IT vendor provided the county clerk with a USB drive containing the security footage, but Collip discovered 28 seconds of video missing. The footage that was missing is allegedly the time when the altercation between Collip and King occurred. On February 27th, Collip received a sunshine request from an unnamed person for the video of the interaction. The lawsuit states the requester wanted footage of the incident, along with 10 minutes of video before and 10 minutes after the disagreement. The USB drive Collip had was too big of a file to email to the requester and she didn't have access to the additional footage that was asked for in the Sunshine request. On February 28th, Deputy Clerk Tammy Miller contacted IT to request the additional video that wasn't originally given to Collip, but the IT vendor told her all video requests have to be approved by Shahan. Documents suggest that this was a change in procedure from when Collip originally requested the footage. On March 1st, Shahan asked Collip for a copy of the pending Sunshine request, and then the county commission met to discuss the matter. Court documents say Collip then received an email from the commission's outside counsel, Ivan Schrader. Schrader told Collip that the audio portion of the video was a closed record because the commission had never intended to record audio. Documents then say Collip was planning to send Schrader's opinion to the requester, but Schrader told Collip to just say, quote, there are no public records related to audio recordings, end quote. This led Collip to contact the Attorney General's office for its opinion. The office said that even though the commission didn't intend to record audio, this doesn't make it a closed record. Documents say a few days after Collip contacted the AG's office, she was provided an invoice dated March 1st, stating the IT vendor said Shahan told him to reformat hard drives to erase data. Court paperwork further explains that Shahan received a copy of the Sunshine request on March 1st, so his decision to delete the footage was made a few hours after the commissioners met to discuss the request. The documents also say there was no public notice or agenda minutes provided for the March 1st commissioner meeting. Collip is seeking a total of $30,000 in civil penalties from the defendants, plus attorney fees. Nick Todorovich, KTVO News. We reached out to both Collip and Shahan today. Shahan told us that he has not been served with the legal documents and can't comment further at this time. Collip is out of the office for meetings this week. Judge Matthew Wilson recused himself, so Judge Kelly Lovecamp of Schuyler County will oversee this case.